everyone. We're just out in our 1967 Alfa Romeo 1750 Spider. Um, this comes from a collection that is a dealer principal front that used to has since sold, but used to own a Porsche store, Jag store, uh, Mercedes Benz dealership, um, and a couple others. And he had this as one of his cars in his own collection. Uh, the restoration shop that we uh, use, um, which is Coach Works, sort of went through uh, for him, going through it, making sure that everything worked when he acquired it, probably three years ago, if I remember correctly. And he just wanted a fun summer toy that was an inexpensive little uh, summer driver that he put the top down, drive, and count on. So I know the car is very well sorted. Driving it right now, everything seems like it functions as it should. I notice there's a little noise from the latch on the soft top. Um, and this visor seems to be falling down a little bit. Easy fixes. But other than that, I feel like everything's working as it should. All the gauges are working as they should. Odometer and speedometer are working as they should. Tax working. We checked all the signals, lights, all that kind of stuff prior. Um, there's not a lot to uh, go through on these cars to uh, decipher things that do and don't work. You have manual windows, manual top, so um, manual mirrors or mirror. Um, but transmission feels great. Clutch engages how it should. Um, go through the gears a little bit here. Pulls like it should. Everything feels really good. Uh, tracks down the road straight. Joel's just trying the heating system now. Probably something that will never be used again. <laughs> it's hot and there's uh, definitely air. You can see it condensating on the windshield a little bit or you could. But that air is hot. I believe that probably moves it down below. Coming out of the vents now. It's coming out of my side too. Okay. So I think you've got a good little sports car for the summer. Um, top down Italian fun. You know, walking around the car, it's got, you know, enough little items that you could pick apart if you wanted to, but we'll call it patina. From 10 feet away, it looks great, but no rust issues or anything that you need to uh, worry about. Um, it's a good little car. If you have any questions at all, uh, reach out to us. We're going to sell this one out of Victoria, British Columbia. Um, we can help with getting it into the U.S. Two things to consider is there is an uh, import duty of 2.5% on the value of the vehicle. And then there is uh, some border expenses, which are, you know, customs broker and importation and whatnot. was usually another eight or $900. Uh, so keep that in mind when you're bidding. If you want a U.S. title, we can assist in getting one um, and uh, arrange shipping for you. But idles perfectly. All the dash is in good shape glass you can tell it isn't new that's for sure in the front windshield but it doesn't have any real eyesight issues you can just see some marks from where the windshield wipers have uh, scored the windshield slightly but a clean little car we'll supply all the invoices from coachworks for the most recent work and uh, make sure that we supply pictures of any books or anything that comes with it so enjoy, reach out, hit the uh, contact seller button if you have any questions, and we'll get back to you ASAP. Thank you again.